there's something to note here about games that end up becoming super rare and super pricey and when you come to realize that sometimes the price of these games ain't based off of them being so classic like right no some of them are because they're so ass that when they stop printing copies and to the point where they get removed from a digital store just says a lot and for some reason that becomes a classic in itself but what's going on everybody i have here the last godzilla game that ever dropped on consoles this was like in 2014 2015 bandai had brought out godzilla the japanese import and for those who can get their hands on the game in general this game for the ps4 cost well over like a thousand dollars and you would think why is there something to this game that kind of you know brings a lot of nostalgia history to godzilla because you guys know godzilla goes way back 50 years or so right plus no it was reported that this game was supposedly ass i don't know you guys could help me in the comment section below it bombed and they just stopped printing the game and they even removed it from the digital stores and therefore you can probably get it through like other collectors ebay perhaps amazon but you're gonna be paying a hefty price i think the ps3 version which we have here as well costs like 60 still 70 sometimes even 200 dollars but i it's to the point where even when a game shits itself they can still be well over a thousand dollars it's insane 60 years ago hold on you know that iconic godzilla roar that was when godzilla first appeared a 50 meter tall kaiju that laid ruin to a city center okay may not have been fast on his feet rotate left and right okay okay i can move oh you rotate you rotate with r1 l1 okay so um <clears throat> with the new godzilla uh x kong movie coming out uh i just got in the mood to want to play but i wish there was a dedicated game between the two okay trample over the okay we know that godzilla's claws and his powerful tail constitute his primary means of attack hey oh shit we also have it on record that he used his oversized upper body to charge at his target okay okay he also lets loose atomic breath a blast attack from his mouth which can turn a town into a sea of fire in seconds okay you know what hold on let me see holy shit grabbing hold of things is also well within his capability okay let's grab a building what the fuck okay this is all the biological data we currently have on record but we know very little about how or why he possesses such unimaginable powers use all godzilla moves bring down the tv tower okay oh my god so this game came out for the ps3 and ps4 and obviously for the ps4 version you have access to certain like i guess skins for godzilla but man bandai like i don't know who oh yeah, wow you cannot move on jesus christ okay oh you better spin that hoe yeah break that shit. yeah okay cool um i think gigabash has godzilla in it right or, or maybe i'm wrong of professor sarazawa's life so many paid the ultimate sacrifice back then but humanity gained two valuable things as a result the first is g energy as a result of our studies we discovered the very essence of godzilla's life force and turned it into a powerful fuel for humanity now without g energy our civilization would fall apart within a very short span of time the second is g-force if the worst should happen in godzilla or anything of equal threat to mankind should ever appear again G-Force is there to remove the threat. Okay. Where you come in, ma'am. 
Okay. As far as the public knows, G-Force is merely a response unit created to handle disasters. If you learn anything, you'll contact me immediately, correct? So now, after 60 years, there are signs that Godzilla has returned. Okay. I'll give you the short explanation, ma'am. Should Godzilla ever appear again, we will need you and the cabinet to set the disaster level. We at G-Force will then respond accordingly. Zilla! So I'm ultimately responsible for our strategy to Godzilla. I will not hesitate to act, soldier. Although it may very well cost me. Damn, these are the cutscenes, bro. I try not to speak, but Jesus Christ, these are the cutscenes we've gotten. So the whole oh, oh, Zilla. Yo, that actually fucked me up. Okay. Uh, okay. God of Destruction mode. King of Kaiju mode. Evolution mode. Uh, it did Rama mode and Kaiju guide. Okay. So you guys, man, we love Godzilla. We got love for Godzilla. You know, let's just make note that Godzilla back in the 60s had eyes. He had human eyeballs. Have we have we addressed that yet? He motherfucker had good eyeballs. Um, but it's insane that we haven't gotten a good King Kong movie either. Uh, have you guys seen that Kong Skull Island bullshit that dropped from Game Mills or whatever the hell they're called? Such disrespect. And then Bandai drops this game. So I'm hoping that it was fun, you know, back in 2015. They didn't get a chance to play it. Uh, go ashore. Let's go ahead and see what we can do here. But um, if there's any Godzilla games from the past that you guys would love for me to like, like play, please comment below. This is disrespectful right here for fucking slideshows, cutscenes. Is this Godzilla? Remember when they used to be like Gaiga, Gaiga? <laughs> <laughs> we cannot determine whether it is the same Godzilla as in our records. Holy like shit. Isn't he like a mutant lizard? Oh, no. No, they get it. Generator. It must be the G energy generator. It's the only explanation as to why he chose to come ashore in this area. We discovered G energy because of him, but it turns out the stuff is his favorite meal. Maybe Godzilla holds a grudge. After all, the reason he was born in the first place was. Uh, uh, forgive me. I spoke out of turn. Oh my god. It's fine. We need to consider all lines of thinking here. Come on. We are going to disaster level one. We must protect. This makes me want to watch the show. That's on Apple TV. Moving to commence level one response, ma'am. Destroy all generators in the area. Generators, uh, house G matter. Kaiju must be defeated if they appear. Hell no. Gaika. Oh, my shit empty. The data collection squad is requesting orders. Oh, let me, let me try to grab this motherfucker right here. Can I not grab him? Oh, what the fuck? I'm collecting data as Godzilla. Let's get it. Data collection is proceeding as planned. <sighs> Who the fuck? L2 to consume breath. Come on. Uh. What the fuck? I I can't attack y'all. It says tutorial. It says energy blast. You got me messed up, sweaty.
Uh, come on. Mm. I'm about to destroy it. Oh, what the fuck happened to me? Damn, why? What it says four on it, right? Let me collect data. Let's go. Area clear. So that was one of the missions for Godzilla. Man, do I fight anybody else? The generator's power levels have hit zero. Godzilla is far larger than when he came ashore, ma'am. It must be the purity of the matter he absorbed. It's accelerating his growth. You were right. He came ashore in search of food. Incredible. But I doubt it'll be enough to satisfy 60 years of hibernation. I wish we knew what Godzilla was thinking right now. Do you think he will search for another food source? Man, if they were making a Godzilla game now, that'd be crazy. I hope they don't call for my head. There's no one else in politics who's equipped to handle such difficult decisions. Okay. Honestly, I'm curious who controls who owns like Godzilla if Warner Brothers also drops Godzilla because if so they could just make a Godzilla just take this away from Bandai all right citizens get anxious when Godzilla is on a rampage uh, in their area this could trigger change in le in leadership so wait am I also playing as the woman who's in control okay but I also play as Gaika Gaika <laughs> oh shit leadership change oh shit how Gaia? Inhabitant of Earth, compassion is key. Come on, defeating Kaiju. So, oh, we have to defeat his ass. Well, I'd rather be Godzilla and just destroy everything in mankind. Godzilla has entered the area. He's going after the generator. Give him some food to chow on, and he'll leave us be. He's no different from the family dog. What? So if I if I Okay, never mind. So y'all not so y'all not doing that, huh? So y'all not y'all not gonna y'all not gonna give give homie food. Alright. Oh my God. We got to destroy this shit. Hmm. I'm gonna destroy the fuck out this city if y'all don't fucking feed me. And I don't know how to destroy those little things too. Godzilla has reached zone four. You know what? Maybe I could destroy helicopters if they come close like that. Squad, begin your assault. Oh man, that boat, I gotta have to take that ship out. That shit is crazy. Mm. Ooh, did I just break out of, of getting that like thing destroyed? Come on. It's not Godzilla. ETA in sixty seconds. Oh, I fell no. Ooh. By collecting data, we are able to discover new strategies we can use to employ against. So I'm playing both sides. Holy shit. Oh my God, that was fucking beautiful, bro. I ain't gonna lie, y'all on my dick right now. 
Don't y'all know who I am? I'm fucking Godzilla, bro. Did I just kill? <laughs> uh, did I just <laughs> did I just kill some of them? Did I just step on their ass? <laughs> did I just step on them? <laughs> oh my fucking goodness, bro! Image coming in. Who the fuck? Oh man, I'm about to whip your ass, Mothly Moth. I'm gonna call you Molly Moth. Huh. Bring your ass over here. Hold on, I'm gonna destroy this shit real quick because y'all not about to. Get your ass over here, Molly Mothra. Come on. Yo, Mothra, get your phony ass. I Mothra. Mothra, move. Mothra, get your ass out. Mothra, get your ass out. You see what I'm doing? Mothra. Oh, shit, Mothra. Come on. Mothra, get your phony ass out, Mothra. Mm. Oh, shit, Mothra, you fucking me up, dude. Hold on. Matra, who the fuck? Oversized Pokemon battle. <laughs> I'm killing. They fucking him up. Yo, Matra, I'm about to. Ooh, Matra, yeah, let's go. Wow. Come on. Bang into him. Oh my god. Why y'all also trying to attack me, bruh? Fucking oversized bug. Move. Oh my God, the frame rate. I ain't gonna lie, he really fucking me up, bro. Come on. Come on. Come on, man. Oh, 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 shit. Come on, kill his ass. I missed. Ah! Bitch. Bitch, I'm Godzilla. The giant kaiju has gone down. Zill. That is crazy. The area has been destroyed by Godzilla. Sometimes they can't help biting the hand that feeds them. Well, that that dude's so ass at being a leader. We only collected up to three data chips, I think. This game. Calculating where Godzilla will most likely hit the shore. Shit, bring me, bring me Mecha Godzilla, man. I'm trying to, I'm trying to turn up, ho. Oh, what the fuck? Y'all about to see how I'm gonna do this thumbnail. I ain't gonna lie, low key, I kind of wanted to start like a little Godzilla uh collection, man, but them motherfucking statues be like $500 for like an eight inch statue. Got me fucked up. Lack of detail ass shit. All right, so let me go ahead. I gotta turn up now. Run right through these buildings. Let's go. And you know what's messed up? I have like a little ounce of enjoyment for the idea of just playing as Godzilla. But man, we're gonna talk at the end of this segment. Hold on. I wanna destroy everything in sight, bro. Bitch. This game has some crazy bug issues, dude. Thank you. 
I'm trying to see if maybe perhaps Come on, destruction level. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh, what the fuck? Uh, <laughs> oh my God, bro. Yo, let's get through this mission, bro. This shit is hilarious. Let's get through this fucking mission. The only little dudes, hold on. Come on. Wait, can I? I just want to hear them go, ah! Come on, bitch. Oh, I'm about to fall on the floor. Oh, shit. That always gets me, bro. Come on. It's like, how do I? You don't have enough time to even leave that, anyways, because the fucking. Shit, bro. What the hell? Oh, my mouse died. Holy shit. Just a world of destruction, huh? Destroy this. I'm about to fall again. Holy shit. Destroy that shit. Wow. Mm, mm. I wonder if anybody who's watching this video was like a fan of this game. I'm bitterly disappointed. Oh, shit, what the fuck happened there? So we play as both and I seem to like cater more to Godzilla and not give a shit about them. That's fucking hilarious. I'll be honest when to go ashore, you go back to stage one. When you resume your progress and everything, okay, you get to continue just really doing the same thing. Then you have King of Kaiju mode, which I think you would have to beat the game or whatever. It says create scenarios using collected figures, um, which I would love to go up against like Mecha Godzilla and them too. So like, you know, I'm conflicted because I would like to unlock these modes, but let's let's now talk about since we're here now. There's no way in hell you can have somebody do the same type of missions over and over and over with no real premise and a man just it gets so repetitive um i did have an ounce of fun just playing as godzilla because i love godzilla and just being able to destroy the city but what this made me want to play was like the old rampage games were like even giga bash i don't even know if they got the godzilla license yet but they definitely have some characters and just you could you know fight each other along with the city and but holy shit in evolution mode you really just evolve Godzilla to be more powerful by using some of the stuff you've collected against the enemies. But I can see why this game bombed. You literally do the same thing over and over. Um, and you have like this picture to picture dialogue, which I don't think really caters to a lot of fans. Um, Where is Godzilla heading? yeah, it's just the same things over and over, you know? So I'm gonna drop it here. I'm gonna say, to be honest, this game really just, I guess, used the skin of Godzilla, threw in some good music to it, some decent music, but it's not worthy to me to be one of the top tier Godzilla games, but yet it's one of the most expensive due to the stoppage of prints and stuff that they've, you know, that they had to put a hold on to due to the game bombing. 
so please let me know what you guys think below if this was ever a game i would continue to play i would probably do it as a fun side game throw throw out to you guys on the weekend but this cannot like i might even want to just run through this game to get to the other modes to create my own scenarios and then bring that to y'all but if there's a better godzilla game out there that you guys would want me to play man drop it in the comment section below this game for being the price that it is fuck no but it's your boy 3mg god bless everybody we almost have 55 motherfucking cake and i'm out of here man peace